day of Vlogtober, guys. I am officially doing Vlogtober this year. There was pretty much a unanimous yes that you guys wanted to do Vlogtober. And I did want to do Vlogtober, but um, I'm probably gonna do something similar to last year where I may not do technically a vlog every single day, but I want to have a video every day because there's definitely still house things going on that I want to share with you. Um, so those may be separate videos or I may do other things. So it is actually 8.20 in the morning, it's Sunday morning. I just got back from the gym, you guys. I actually joined a gym, but technically we are part of the Y because Evie was doing swim lessons at the Y and then they had like a special promotion over the summer where you could join for free and you could get like 20% off if you joined with somebody. So I found a buddy in our neighborhood um, to join with me, so we both got a discount on the rate and I have like full access of the gym and classes and Evie gets dis discounted glasses, right? Isn't that exciting? Yeah. <laughs> so I've been going to the gym. So um, one of the best parts of it is I can go and work out and then shower and get ready and then come back home and you know get on with my day. And they also have childcare, so it's it's a beautiful thing. So went to the gym at like 6.30, 6.40 this morning I got ready, so I just got home, and obviously Dan's still here, so he's gonna head out to go to church a little earlier. Um, he helps to like set up and stuff, and I'm gonna make a smoothie for breakfast. I haven't made a smoothie pretty much, well, I'm a couple times over the summer, but I haven't been doing it very often. Um, so I just restocked on like all my favorite things, so I'm gonna make a smoothie, and this one is- We've got frozen mango. We sure do. <laughs> Okay, so in here right now I have some frozen banana and I'm gonna put in some of this cashew milk. I like to do the bananas first because they're they're frozen and then that makes sort of like a good base to throw the other things in. So I'm gonna put mango and I have a half of an avocado which helps also to make it really nice and creamy and then this like power blend which is a mix of different greens that are good. So that is gonna be today's smoothie. So there is a very green smoothie. Very delicious. It's dinosaur smoothie. The dinosaur smoothie? Yeah. And I just have to mention what a glorious fall day it is outside. It is officially like October weather and it's amazing. Okay, we're just getting ready to head out the door. Today we're actually gonna be going to my parents later after church to celebrate my mom's birthday. So I just am wearing this cause dress that I showed in my fall capsule wardrobe video which I'll link to if you want to watch it, if you didn't. Um, I really like it, it's like a sweater dress, and like I said, it's really chilly outside today, so I feel like it's gonna be perfect. Then I have on my little monogram necklace that is um, has an E and an L, and the girl's birthstones on it, which I bought, or I think Dan bought it for me, for Mother's Day, I think. Um, so I think that looks really nice, because this dress is sort of greenish. So we're gonna get some sippy cups and get Lara dressed and then we're gonna head out to church. Okay, we are back home from church and I just stopped home, ran in and got a couple things. Made myself a nice coffee, grabbed some hummus to have a snack and then some clothes for the girls and PJs because we like to change them into their pajamas before we head home. So now I'm just, I need to run to the grocery store. Like I said, we're celebrating my mom's birthday and my sister and I are actually gonna be cooking dinner. Um, my brother is bringing something and we're bringing something and we're all gonna kinda cook together at my parents' house. So I need to go to the grocery store, get some things to dip in my hummus <laughs> to have a little snack. My brother's bringing, I think, veal and then we're making to make like potatoes and some eggplant something or other. Good morning. <laughs> Wanna get some groceries? It's very hard. Monday morning now and I just didn't vlog at all yesterday so we went to my parents at like two o'clock like I said and we were basically there for the rest of the day we made dinner for my mom and just hung out with family so I wound up not vlogging at all and I think even in years past 
I, I don't really vlog that much around other people. I enjoy vlogging at my home and you know my life, but I don't really want to vlog other people's homes and my family. So I didn't really film anything else while I was there. But we did make a delicious dinner. Um, we made something called a caponata, which is like a eggplant, roasted eggplant, and olives, and tomatoes, and you like cook it down, it has vinegar in it, and we may put it on top of veal, and we made mashed potatoes, so that was dinner last night. And it was very delicious. I'll actually put the link down below of the recipe that we used for the caponata. It was really, really good. Um, but now we're back home, and I think I'm just gonna finish filming for the morning, and then I'll try to edit this video and put it up for you today, like this afternoon maybe, while Lyra's napping. And then you can have today's video today, actually. And then I'll finish, you know, filming throughout the day for the next day. So a little bit of a late start to Vlogtober this morning or this year because it started on a Sunday and Sundays for us are usually like out with friends and family day. So I'm going to try to do better for the rest of the month. Um, but now I'm just going to get the kitchen a little cleaned up and make breakfast. So I'm making my coffee in my trick and treat mug which I've had for quite a few years now and it's funny because when I bought it I had no idea who Ray Dunn was I didn't know anything about this being like trendy or anything like that but I just really like the mug and I only use it this time of year so I'm just making my coffee this is how I get my coffee really frothy for those that have wondered or asked I have an Arrochino which is part of our Nespresso machine but the Nespresso, you only get like a little, you know, a little shot of espresso and then it's a lot of milk. But I kind of prefer more coffee and just a little bit of foamed milk on top. So I just use it with my Keurig and make, you know, just froth milk on top of regular coffee. So we're making eggs right now. We're gonna have toast and that's gonna be breakfast. So for toast, the girls are having this organic soft multigrain. And I'm having this Three Bakers Ancient Grains. It's like a, a gluten-free bread, but it just has a lot of good grains in it and it's frozen, you gotta keep it in the freezer. I've used the, um, what's that one called? Ezekiel bread that is frozen and I do really like that, but I thought I would just try this one out. I saw it at the store, so we're gonna have this with our eggs. So on my toast, I had some avocado, so I put that on. And then I'm gonna use this garlic pepper seasoning grinder. I like how this tastes with the avocado toast. So I'm gonna sprinkle a little of that on and have my eggs and my coffee, and we'll be good to go. He. All right, so we're just done with breakfast and we're watching uh, one YouTube video. We're watching San and Sarah's uh, daily vlogs from Marital Glue. And then we're going to be giving the girls baths because they really needed baths this weekend and it just didn't happen so Evie still has her ponytail in from yesterday um, that she slept in because we got home late but we're gonna give them baths and get ready for this day we do need to go grocery shopping so we're gonna do that I have laundry going right now that I need it's probably done I probably need to switch it into the dryer I usually do about two loads of laundry like every other day I guess I probably could do a load of laundry every day and I do sometimes uh, but usually over the weekend I don't really do laundry so then Monday is like catch-up day which I'm sure it is for a lot of people so that's the plan for the day In case you're wondering, yes, I am wearing the same dress as I was wearing yesterday. I just realized that. Um, I actually do this kind of a lot, just like with my hair. I don't wash my hair all the time. I don't wash my clothes like every single time that I wear them. So especially in the weekend, you know, Sunday into Monday, if I'm not gonna be seeing anyone from Sunday, I'll, I'll re-wear something on Monday because it's not dirty necessarily. I could still get another day's wear out of it. Um, so yeah, I'm re-wearing the same outfit as yesterday. Does anyone else do that? Because I do it a lot. Hey. Bath time, Lara. Come here. Time for a bath. Yeah, put this down. All right, I got all the dishes done. Those things will just dry. I'm actually going to go ahead and wash our sponges, which I do every, I don't know, maybe once a week or so, if I remember because I think it really extends the life of them so you don't have to just throw them out 
you know, when they start to get kind of funky and it really does help to like refresh them. So I'm gonna throw those in there. Oops, I'm gonna put this guy at the bottom. I'm gonna run this and then the bath is done filling. So I'm gonna give the girls a bath and usually while they're in the bath, I can get myself sort of ready for the day. And like I said, we're gonna go out and go to uh, groceries. So I'm actually just gonna call it a vlog here. I know this is kind of a weird part yesterday and part this morning, but thank you for joining us this morning for the first day of Vlogtober. Like I said, I'm gonna edit this and you'll see it hopefully on the second uh, day of Vlogtober and then we should be back on schedule from here out. But thanks so much for watching today. If you're excited about Vlogtober, give this video a thumbs up. I have so many fun ideas and things we wanna do with the girls and just fun things and Evie starting preschool this month, which is crazy. So we got a busy, exciting month ahead of us and I'm excited for you guys to join in with us. Thanks for watching guys. Bye.